Hi everyone, welcome to Yen's Family Table. If you're looking for a sweet treat for Easter, you've come to the right place. Make these easy peasy bird's nest pretzel bites for Easter baskets and your kitties will love you. Hell, the grown-ups will too. So let's go. First, let's make some caramel sauce. If you don't want to deal with making caramel, then just skip this step. But if you want to make the best chocolate caramel pretzel bites, then watch on. In a high-sided pot over medium heat, heat up sugar and a bit of water. The water is only there to slow down the caramelization of the sugar, so you have more time to react and less likely to burn the sugar. Get the melting started at the beginning by stirring with the spoon, but stop stirring as the sugar and water starts to heat up. Use a swirling motion to mix to minimize the risk of any crystallization of the sugar. And now just watch it closely. Do not walk away because this will happen in minutes. As the sugar heats up, at first it will be foamy and cloudy on the surface. Then that will turn into large and small clear bubbles. As the water evaporates, you'll see that the clear liquid starts to turn yellow and then quickly into an amber color. Be careful here because you might think the amber color is not dark enough, but you need to take it off when you have a golden syrup or honey shade of amber and add the butter immediately and whisk to dissolve. The heat from the sugar will continue to cook and give you the right caramelization. Once the butter has been whisked in, pour in the cream and whisk to combine until you have a smooth caramel sauce. It is really hot and runny right now, so easy to pour it into a dish and leave it to cool down. When it has cooled completely, you'll end up with a thick texture, unctuous sauce that is to die for. Spoon over ice cream, put it in a pie, drizzle it over cheesecake. So many ways to enjoy this amazing caramel sauce. But today, we'll be using it for our chocolate caramel pretzel bites. And don't forget these colorful Easter mini eggs. I get them every year, and this year I decided to do something with them. The rest of this fun and easy treats are, melt the chocolate in a microwave in 30 second intervals. You can use milk or dark chocolate, but as always, buy a good quality one. It will make a world of difference. Once melted, just dump the pretzel sticks in and mix to cover each stick with the chocolate. Then get a tray and line it with the parchment paper. Spoon appropriate amounts of chocolate cover pretzel sticks for each nest. And try to arrange the sticks to resemble a bird's nest, complete with an area in the middle for eggs. Drizzle with the caramel sauce. And then top with the mini eggs. Now all you have to do is to set this in the fridge and when they are hardened, remove from the paper and enjoy. How easy is that? A decadent, sweet and salty treat that is easy and fun to make. Both kids and adults will love this any time of the year. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and comment below. As always, go to yensfamilytable.com for the full written recipe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.